Hello everyone, welcome to Bargain Gaming, where we can play excellent games without busting our wallets. Uh, this is episode 75 of uh, Dead Island 2, and uh, we just finished the mission, uh, like Terror on Stage Sound Stage 7. So, as I said before, uh, every time we finish either any one of the side quests or the main quest line, all the loot boxes, I mean the safe like in Emma's place, we're currently in Emma's place, all the safe will respawn. This lockbox here will respawn and it gives us eleven eleven sixty six dollars. So almost twelve hundred dollars. So if we are short so that's one of the reasons why uh, I'd like to dedicate this episode to is uh, getting access to cash and um, weapons that can help us uh, pay for the expensive uh, repairs or upgrades of our weapons. So Bel Air is where the cash is. So we come here to go for uh, the what do you call this? The the lockbox in. Uh, Emma's house, so that's Bel Air. The second place we need we can go to is uh, Venice Beach. Uh, in Venice Beach, we can go to the Blue Crab Grill, right? In the Blue Crab Blue Crab Grill will give us again another lockbox, which will produce about eleven hundred dollars. So both Emma and here will already give us two uh, two two thousand two hundred or two thousand three hundred dollars. And aside from that, uh, on Venice Beach, the second alternative aside from Blue, Blue Crab Restaurant is the tower where Sergeant Rodriguez is or W O W is W O W Rodriguez is. And that in that area, it will give us ammunition and also a either a pistol or a submachine gun. And those are all uh, like rare weapons, right? Uh, so that would be two, two lock boxes and two uh, and one weapon. And then in Venice Beach, we can also run to the police station. The police station will have a few mobs in it, uh, not that not that many, uh, just a few mobs, and we can use our bait and then a grenade to wipe most of them out. So right now we are in the Blue Crab restaurant. Uh, we're in the Blue Crab restaurant. So this is the map. And down the basement, we will get the cash. Here is the lockbox, and it will give us eleven ninety four. So that's almost twelve hundred. And all of these respawn, and we get more metal parts, and also all of these items that is in the safe area like if we need a medikit they respawn uh, and of course uh, the items that this guy is holding also respawn so he's got meat cleavers and a uh, meat and meat hammers and meat cleavers oh a 22 rifle okay slaughtering deer horn okay so we don't need that and the other thing, like I said, is that uh, we can go directly to the police station. In this map, we have the we are here, where the yellow mark is, and the police station is right just out here. And there is uh, see, this is the the blue shield, uh, the shield for the police. So we will head right there, and. There we can kill off a few zombies. Wait, uh, let us change our inventory so we have on the curveball. We instead of the bomb, we will have the bait. 
And then we'll just run very quickly to the police station. There is the police station. We can see that in a distance. Is there somebody pursuing us? Okay. And we got our bait in, our bait out. We can just dump it right between these two cars. Right, and then we'll go to the grenade. And that's the police station right here. See, the nice thing with the police station is, is that it has two box, a, a red box like this, which will yield us, whoa, burst fire. So it yields us one item. And then we go further in. It will give us shot shells also. Some, in short, some ammo. Uh, where is our shotty? Okay, let's our shotty up and ready. Oh, we just picked up some police uh, pistol rounds. But the biggest uh, item here is that red box here. And then we will also pick up this gun over here. And we picked up a bunch of bullets. And there's also a bunch of supplies here that we can pick up. So these are for... Uh, so our rifle is maxed out. Our shotgun is maxed out. Uh, okay, this is maxed out. Oh, we're short on pistol rounds. So in Venice Beach, we already... What, we picked up a bunch of items, uh, two items, and cash in the blue crab. So let's get out of here. We can go straight to the... What's the rifle rounds? Fasteners. And... Um, on the map so so we pick up a thousand here and then at the police station we picked up two what do you call this uh, two uh, two guns right we picked up this one which is a purple and we picked up a an assault shotgun so the the red boxes are very nice. That's what they drop. And the next place we want to go to would be heading straight. We can head, we can run all the way north or we can come over here back to our base and then uh, use the fast travel. We can do that. Let's, let's go back to our base and then we can uh, fast travel because I want to check uh, what what do we get here when we killed off these guys? Oh, well, nothing much, huh? Really? Nothing much. Okay. So we can run all the way back to our fast travel point and then fast travel to the tower Ooh. 
No, is there something here? Okay, nothing. Okay. <clears throat> the f anyway, within the zone, the fast uh, fast travel is very fast. Here we we will go to the tower, and then the tower will give us ammunition, and almost always a pistol or a machine pistol. So now we're picking up another machine pistol. So there are more bullets for us. Uh, and then there are even more bullets up here. Ammunition, I mean. See, there are more ammunition up here. Uh, here. Shotgun, rifle, gunpowder. Where the hell's what? It's nothing. Just trying to find some assets. Shit was so much easier to find when I could just send Delgado to go get it. That was one squirrel who knew where to find his nuts. So there's another shotgun shell here. It was also the reason no one could find half the stuff in the first place. I swear he invented the filing system just to get a And then she is heavy in assault shotguns and uh, rifles. So this one is also a good one. This one, it's a sporting rifle. Uh, it's like a sniper scope uh, because it has a telescope rather than a uh, uh, I forgot the uh, the other one uh, it's it's and we are 43 here we're maxed out M max out on shot shells oh we we're, we're still short on pistol rounds max out Arise on out okay I'll be so much easier with you here, Delgado. See, okay. We get bullets and we can uh, check with her and we got this gun here, right? We got this. So now we have, as far as our inventory is concerned, we have three extra guns. Which, uh, this machine pistol, this assault shotgun from the police station, and this one also from the red box in the police station. So the next place we want to go to is um, the, uh, what do you call this? Um, Halperin Hotel. Halperin Hotel has two red boxes. And uh, again, so that will give us two more weapons. And then in the previous episode, when we were doing Terror on Sound Stage Seven, we we found out. Uh, it, I was reminded that there are actually two red boxes there, which we looted in the previous episode. So that means we now have like four or five box, five red, five red boxes to loot from. Two in Halperin, two in Sound Stage Seven Monarch Studios, and one at the police station. So we we will be getting a lot of weapons. So although we can only find like cash about twenty three hundred from both Bel Air, Emma's house, at the Blue Crab Cafe, uh, Blue Crab restaurants, we can sell those to. Four, six. We should be able to gather up to six weapons, and this weapon is about two to three thousand uh, dollars. So that should be. So, let's say okay. Here at the hotel, we will go down the hotel. Uh, how many weapons have we so far? Three, right? Yeah, one, two, and three. Okay, let us keep. Uh, Let's uh, keep this one. So this one can... Oh, what do we have right now? This is also a burst fire. Burst fire carbine. And this is a burst fire... But this is 23 and this is 22. So we can keep this one for the moment. Uh, these other two also. So in case... Uh, so we don't run out of... Uh, out of... Uh, invent, uh, backpack space. And we go out the back door. What are we using? We're using the bat. 
And again, there are also resources here that we can pick up. Right? These are two fasteners here. And meat bait. And we go out this way and head towards the truck. This is the truck. And we turn off the water pipe here. So we need to give it some time so that the Wow, the stomp is so powerful. So we need to give it time so, uh, for the uh, electricity or for the water to dry up. And then we can come back here and pick up. So that's a red, red crate. And it's going to drop at least a blue item. And hopefully uh, a purple item. So we're currently at level... Yeah, right now. Like right now. Ouch, 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 ouch. So it gave us a blue item. Right? It gave us a blue item. Yeah, another machine pistol at 23. At uh, level 23. And so there are all kinds of suitcases that we can actually uh, pick up here. And then the next one is to get into the garage. Wait, 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 wait. Yeah, the garage in here. And then behind on to the right. We will encounter a mob here. Whoa, 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 whoa. And we don't have to kill people. We just uh, shoot and scoot. Right? So... <laughs> Just shoot and scoot. No, no. Or loot and scoot. <laughs> so what did we get? Uh, here, we got two items, right? The This gun and uh, this pitchfork. And they're both 23. And uh, I think... And the last one, let's see if we can... Re this is back to Monarch Studios. And I'm trying to see if we can remember where we the red box says are. One is outside in the parking lot, uh, in a f in a container, in a freight container, which is half open. Uh, the other one is up on a scaffolding. Uh, so I'm t I, we just need to remember where we kept those things, and then uh, once we have everything. Uh, we can go back to any way station and then uh, sell the extra, right? We picked up, I think we picked up three from the prior one. Three, yeah, three from the prior one. And two here in Halprin, so we have five, five weapons. Uh, two in the police station, one at the tower. And two in Halperin, so Halperin Hotel. So we got five weapons. And hopefully I can remember where in Monarch Studios. Uh, okay, if we put a marker here. Who's the one that keeps talking? See, we, we try to talk to them here. This radio is not working. Uh, is it somewhere up here? 
I keep getting uh, like somebody's. It seems like somebody's trying to talk to us, but uh, but whenever when but it gets all anyway. Let's. We are looking for cash here. And we don't want to deal with people. Wait, wait. Uh... Whoa. Studio Seven. Okay, this is the back of Studio Seven. Okay, at least we got something back. Rifle rounds. Oh, whoa, whoa. Ouch. We need to get out of there. That is another one of those guys. Man, that thing in Studio 7 
Okay, what was that thing? Ooh, a police baton. So again, that's something we can sell, and it will offset some of the cost of. It's that other side. I think it's on that side. Yeah, this... Okay. Okay. Here, I think I remember this. This is a scaffolding that leads up, right? Yeah, this is a red box right here. I don't know it has... Oh, it has respawned. Okay, uh, we opened it before, so it hasn't respawned. But it would have respawned because the mission was done here, so it did not respawn yet because uh, we already took that. Oh. Okay, these cleaning guys. Okay, that's one, and then the other one is in the parking lot. But, okay, so... I guess, okay, uh... Okay, I guess we just go back then. Hey, Sarah. I found Sebastian. Alive and well. Oh, can't thank you enough for this. If you ever need to take a break, you're welcome to join us behind the big green screen. I'm keeping the area safe. <laughs> so by coming here, we found Sebastian. Right? So, what happens? Let's go back here. Maybe this thing has respawned because... Uh I think, uh, yeah, that was the, um, the problem is we are in the area when we finish the mission, so this, yeah, this will not respond. We have to be out of the area. Okay. Anyway, uh, our timer went off, so I guess this would be a good place to cut the episode right here. Uh, thank you guys for joining me. I hope you join me in the next episode. Bye.